time now for another edition of the Racing Dude. It's way too early Kentucky Derby Day. Welcome back to RaceDudes.com. I'm Magic, and today we're taking a closer look at Kentucky Derby contender Quavassier, who won the Jerome Stakes at Aqueduct on New Year's Day. And with me to discuss Quavassier further in depth is Aaron Halterman. Aaron, on the free race preview at RacingDudes.com, you correctly picked Quavassier to win this race, but the time came back pretty slow. The buyer figure came back even worse than the time was. What did you think of Quavassier here? <laughs> well, look, I was super happy, right? <laughs> he won and he paid $10. I thought he was great. Uh, look, it, there's no way around it. This was a really, really slow race. Now, part of it could have been the track at Aqueduct was kind of a mess. It was sloppy. It was foggy. It just looked like a winter day in New York. But it, this horse is all about projected improvement. He's he's not going to win another race running that slow uh, at this level, right? It, it, I mean, it's just not very likely. But the horse does have a pedigree that suggests going longer will be good. He's actually won at a mile and an eighth already. That's how he broke his maiden. So that's good. He has early speed. That's good. So there's positives here. He's got to get better. Um, he has been getting better with each start. So, you know, there there are some things where like, oh, I can project this horse will be pretty good. But, you know, bottom line is he's got to get much faster as we go along here. Um, and hopefully he does. But th this race wasn't anything to write home about. That's for sure. There are four Kentucky Derby preps on January 1st this year. Uh, where would you rank Quavassier when the Jerome win amongst New Grange in the Sham, Dash Attack uh, in the Smarty Jones, and Simplification in the Mucho Macho Man? I mean, if we're rating just the performance, it has to be fourth. I mean, there's the numbers say so. Visually, uh, as I'm trying to get this four to one shot home, I'm like, is he ever going to get to the wire? And thank God nobody's closer behind him. So th I mean, this race, you put this race against those other ones. Obviously, it doesn't look good for Kulvasier. And again, though, he does have a right to improve. And so that's the big thing about it. Um, you know, if you're going to look at him just today, can he go on and win a race like the Withers even? I'm, I'm not real sure. But can he improve? Yes. So that's going to be the big key with him. Uh, but he's definitely fourth amongst the ones ran on January 1st. Head over to racingnews.com. We have free picks for every race, every track around the country. You can get our free race previews, our major stakes recaps, our live stream shows, and our full Kentucky Derby Trail coverage at youtube.com slash racing news. Leave a comment below with your thoughts on Quavassier. Do you think he's going to win the Withers Stakes in his next start? Is this his ceiling? Let us know below. Hit like if you like this video. Hit subscribe if you really like it. Tell all your friends, and we'll see you at the track. This has been another edition of the Racing Dude. Way to... Early Kentucky Derby Day.